So here we have uh, Sumner Malik in the commentary area. It's basically like sitting out in a nice garden, isn't it, with the plastic chairs and the uh, AstroTurf uh, around us. But uh, how are you doing, fella? You're all good? It's a bit, bit cold out there, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit chilly. You've got shorts on. PJ thing. and I, we should have our fur, well, fake fur coats on. A sure leads, one game to love. Who's the best squash player in the family? Um, the best squash player in the family is probably Bravo. Curtis. Yeah. And then Perry. Yeah. And then Toro. Your sister. So two boys and then your sister. And then probably my dad. Yeah. And then Bailey and Heston and then me. Okay. So your mum's the worst. Down. Uh, she she doesn't play. Oh, uh, okay. One love. It's probably wise. It's, uh, it's nice to uh, for her to have a bit of a break. If you're all playing squash. When did you? What age were you when you started playing? Um, I now. think it was um, about half. Two love. Five. Wow. Really? It was five. I was really how, old, how old were you, PJ? I was uh, I was 11. Really? Actually, yeah. When I when I very first hit a squash ball, I was 11. Yeah. You were a footballer, weren't you, PJ? I enjoyed my soccer. Yeah, my football. Yeah, football One, is boring. <laughs> <laughs> Squash is much better, eh? Yeah. Good lad. You, you have to run around more and stuff. Yeah. And and the rallies are longer. That's are. true. You need to be fitter for squash, that's for sure. You need to be and very fit. Football is just running about and kicking the ball. Yep. And then you just like shoot a goal and that's ah. it. Yeah. This Go is on. more individual as well, isn't it? Yeah. In football, you've got you obviously your ten teammates, in, but this is more independent. In, and in football, you're just like sitting there watching it, and it just seems Down. so boring. Yeah, yeah. I Four think you share one. the same opinion as a lot of people. Well, Rami Shaw Sumner is cruising at the early stage of this. Dasuki's not having a look in at all. He doesn't seem um, he doesn't seem too well today. Yeah. He's not. How did he play yesterday? He had a day's rest, but the match he, he played before uh, the day before yesterday, Five he played 100 one. minutes, so one hour 40 with Adnan of Malaysia, and he got huge cramps at the end in his legs. So he's, although he's had a bit of a day's rest, he still hasn't properly recovered, I would say. It was a pretty brutal match, wasn't it, PJ? Oh, physically, it was one of the longest. I think there's been one longer match this week, and that was 103 minutes. Wasn't it? So that was the second longest match in this World Championship. So physically, even though he's had a day's rest, he, he's, you can see he's feeling it. He's not moving as quickly and as well as he was good. Good. a couple of days All ago. Good. Yeah, I could tell. Yeah. All balls good. Confirmed. Left box, 6-1. But Sumner, PJ and I were saying this is the first time for a long time, if not the first that we've seen Ramir Shaw in the earlier rounds of an event win so convincingly and look so focused and strong yeah so that's uh, a worrying sign for his opponents hence him being one love and six one up against the suki this is that camera angle again this is camera angle number two this is quite a good experience for the is he's coming into this quarterfinals of the world championships and he's playing the best player in the, well, in the modern in the modern game, isn't he? When, so he, when he's fit, yeah, when I would say. I Even mean, when he's not fit, he seems <laughs> to d produce some pretty amazing <laughs> yeah. things. Rami seems, Rami seems to get a lot of stuff back. He does, doesn't he? That's yeah. the other side of it, you see, Sam. Everyone talks about Find how Rami is short. Six. Is so brilliant with his racket, you know, playing all those lovely shots. He but also he just mostly gets everything back. He does. So, so that's imagine what that. makes him a good player. Exactly. So he's basically he's a complete player because he's able to really attack his opponents, but he's also able to get, as you say, lots of balls back. Yeah. And that's very tough as an opponent when you've got somebody and like that to play seven against. Seven two. You can see it how he's how Dasuki he's looking quite tired. perplexed and tired yeah, already. He does, yeah. He's looking a little bit as though he doesn't quite know what to do to win a point against Remy Shaw at the moment. You warm enough? Yeah. yeah. OK, 
again using lovely height. We talk about some of the front wall and Ramya Shaw is able to hit hard and low balls but also lobs and use that whole front wall. It makes it very tough again for his opponent. It's a nice shot though from Dasuki. Yeah. It's a nice drop. Hand out. Into the neck. Can you play this one? Curtis can. Can he? He can yeah. play the backhand drop in the neck. That's, the one, that's probably one of his best shots. Is it? It's a good one to have if you can. That's Which one's in Curtis? The, that one in the, um, on the right hand side of the two brothers. No, not that one. The one no, the old, the oldest. Oh, okay. Just as we were coming out. There he we get it, there he is. There he is. He's the best player in the family, yeah. Yeah. Have you ever played on the glass court? Um, this one. Have you hit on this one? No. No. Um. I've been on a lot of glass courts, Manchester, yeah. um, we St George's. We yeah. used to train there actually, some of them. Um, we were playing for England. So you know, we used to train on that glass court. Uh, what other? Um, St George's, Manchester. Abbeydale, that one, it's not. Yeah, Abbeydale, four, yeah. Seven. Yeah. I think that's it. Well, that's not bad. It's pretty Ten good. Ten years old, you played on three glass courts. Three more than a lot of people. Um, you know Manchester one? Yeah. yeah. It's too bright. Really? Don't like it. You can't really see the ball. So what shot should you play if your opponent can't see the ball, do you think? What would be very effective? Get it high. Yep, the lob. To the back. The high lob. I like the way your mind works. Do with actually getting a bit of advice from you, both of us, about the game, to be honest. We'll have to have a bit of a, a catch-up later <laughs> on after we've done this job. Just looks very, very comfortable, doesn't he, Ramya Shaw? Yeah, he looks. Um, he doesn't look tired, and he looks like he's got a good night's sleep last night. <laughs> he did. That's the first slightly strange shot we've seen, but See this, it's a nice tight ball from the okay. Oh, that pickup yeah, was okay. Pickup yeah, was yeah. good there good. from Dasuki. You can see the size yeah. of his legs there, some of the five oh, seven. powerful, aren't they? Yeah. Strong. Big calves. Big, big calves. calves, yeah. Very PJ big likes calves. likes likes it when the players have got big calves. <laughs> He's always commenting on the legs. Oh, he's got to go and play the Decision. ball there. There's Dezuki. a line inside of Remy no Short on the left-hand side. Did you review he, he actually could have got on that if he Decision. went the right way. Yep, I agree. You're 100% right there. Well, we've got so a video review this. again. Look, yeah. He's gone into the back of Remy, hasn't yeah, he? Yeah, he's gone sideways into the back of him. So what do you reckon? Do you reckon that's going to be upheld, Sumner? It's a no let. I think you're right there. I think this is going to be upheld. He's and it is. Right. Okay. Well, I tell you no, what, well, that's the cameraman, uh, that's the commentators no and the referees that jobs are now in jeopardy with this young man. Go to the ball. Can actually take over all three. Go to the ball. Go to the ball. See? So Roy Ginger will just translate go to, to you the ball. again. You look for the man. He's saying go for the ball. Tasuki is saying that he was playing five. Grammy Ashore, as you said, and he could have gone on the inside yeah. between Ashore and the side ball. Mm -hmm. Good decision. Nice tight. Well, that's yeah, good. Very good. Very tight. Because say tight. Well. Say say Six, tight. Eight. Tight. Good very well. <laughs> very well. Superb. Tight. Well, your prediction. You think that the Suki might sneak this second game? I can assure you, it's looking it's pretty looking good. He is. He's getting his. It's quite close as well. It yeah. is. He's getting his teeth into it, and Ashore actually looks a little bit more, not as fresh as what we saw earlier. So sweating a lot, isn't he? He is. Yeah. Working, Working hard, hard out there. The Suki's like dripping. Yeah. He always likes to have these chats with himself, eight. doesn't he? You see sure. Sure you've he's seen him. He's yeah, he's always like talking in his head. Yep, exactly. To think what he's going to do next. Decision. <laughs> 
Suzuki <laughs> that was a has quick... led six There's eight. no way that's a stroke. Because he lots turned around. Lots of room. But lots of room. He turned around, so I'm also, as Roy Gingell saying, there's lots of room. We see where Ramia Shaw is. Eight. The ball's quite yeah. tight on the Suzuki. Because he was, like, at the side of the other side. Yeah, exactly. He was past the line and the ball was near the box. Quality squash, really good quality. Dasuki's showing uh, some glimpses there, PJ. Yes, PJ's a fan of Dasuki's. He feels that six, potentially eight. he could really dominate on the PSA World Tour. Technically, he's very, very good. Oh, he's very powerful. Yeah. Very, I just think he's only 22 years old, so he's still got a little bit of experience to gain. But I think if he gets that sorted out, he's got so many uh, great attributes. I think he could be one to watch. Who do you think will be the next? Who do you think um, this next year coming will be probably the best um, pro? Coming through, somebody yeah. that's not there already, like oh, not like a um, Shibagi or like um, Curtis and. Um, <laughs> well, we need England do need some uh, players after Nick Matthew, Jay's Wills, Trout, and Daryl Selby. Yeah. So if you'd like to have a word with Curtis and tell him to get a move on, that'd be great. Join the PSA World Tour. They're doing a discount at the moment the membership two for the price of one yeah, that's quick good awareness from Romeo Short slightly loose uh, counter work from and both players but then nine, six. just got stuck in there really to Suki your prediction's going a bit wonky here Sumner yeah yeah Romeo's just too into it yeah He's too into it too focused isn't he yeah He's got it all worked out. He has got it, and he's not making many unforced errors again, just like that first game. Suki's finding it hard to win points. It's too good. That was Ten, six, what you were talking ball. about earlier, Sumner, about how he's able to place the ball in such good areas of the courts, not just the front. I mean, he's had an outright winner in the back there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, four game balls for a short. Suki's looking tired again. Yeah. Oh, that's brilliant, though, that's for, for Suki. Can Curtis play that one? Hand yeah, down, seven, nice ten, game ball. Oh. I mean, it's like I say, it's very cold out. It's the coldest evening we've had here, but you see how hard these guys are working. Suki's t shirt's completely drenched. Ramage is just a bit, just a bit wet. But not, it's not soaked, is it? No. So it means that Ramage's making him run more. Exactly. Yes. 7 10. Game ball. I think this game's going to go to Rami. He's got three game balls now. He's had one already. Yeah. Decision Dazuki. Video decision. Video Dazuki. decisions. So a bit of activity with the well, video the ref again. Question here, Sumner. Is there enough room to the right-hand side of Rami Ashore? Could Dazuki go around and play that ball? I think that's what the referees will be looking for. Um... You see how Tosuki runs into the back of Rami a little bit. Yeah, I, I think he turns around a bit as well. Yeah. Um, I think he should have went round. Should have gone round and played it. Yeah. Mm, interesting one. I'll prob prob probably say a let. Would you? Okay. Yeah. Wow, you're on the ball. Yes, let You put seven, me and ten. PJ to shame, you Game know, with ball. all these decisions. We get we get abuse all the time from people saying we don't know what we're talking about. <laughs> you certainly do. No, that's actually true sometimes. Well, we don't know what we're talking about. <laughs> yeah. 
You're just talk load of nonsense. <laughs> oh my goodness, all coming out in the wash now, isn't it? Wow. Goodness gracious. Right. I think you're well, right. I think what you're, you're you're thinking about Simon Park, the other commentator. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. He's the one that uh, sometimes loses his voice. So he's had too much ball already. Game, two game balls. So what do you think about this? So we're talking about the glass courts again. Now this glass court with the side doors opening and there's no back door. Do you quite like that? Well, I was thinking I f think it's quite good because um, so there's not a door at the front so no one can come off and just start arguing Eight, with the ref. Ten. Yeah, Game that's ball. a very good point and that's one of the reasons why they did it actually. That's what I... I wondered why they did that. Yeah. And I thought it might maybe because they come off the court. Yep. Yeah, that's a good point. And so they come off at that su at their sides that Decision they're on, Zuki. so they don't yes, have to go around. Yep. Eight, ten, game ball. It also helps with the, because squash is primarily filmed from the back of the court, so the fact you haven't got a door frame and all the rest of it, it's a clear back wall, it actually looks a little bit clearer when you're watching it as well. Yeah. See? It does look clearer as well, yeah. I can't believe you think of PJ and I. Oh, 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 oh. Dear, oh dear. That's a, what's that? That's a thanks for. Nine, ten. Game thanks ball. for coming. You heard that one before? No. No. Okay. Well, you can say it. Just say it then. But that's one of the best necks I've seen this week. That was a pretty, pretty good one. Nine, just like ten, Curtis <laughs> when he just and Perry's when he played Jack no. Nutter last year. Well, Sumner, sorry to butt in there, the but you were being uh, has one video review targeted by PJ about your prediction, but now suddenly it's a tie break. So things are looking pretty good for you. Can Dasuki sneak this one? What do you think, PJ? I'm just going to agree with whatever Sumner says. Because <laughs> he seems to know more than me. I, I, I think um, Dasuki would just be able to sneak this one in because he's actually buckled up and started playing well. Yeah, he's he has. got back into it. He has, very much. There's an appeal from ashore, but the pickup was pretty good, I feel. Oh, goodness. It's tight. Oh! Oh! It's down. Yeah, top of the tin. It's a flurry of unforced right errors from Rami Ashore here, late so on I, in the I, second. Yeah, I think he's going to see this one. Game I think ball. he's going to nick it. He's going to go into one all. Game ball for Ferres de Suki. This is a good match play. 11-10, game ball. Very good match play. World Championship stuff. Oh, he's hit the tin. It's a big miss. Pretty far down in the tin as well. It wasn't even close for Suki. Back to 11 all. Yeah. 11 all. This is close. It's a really good game. Better than the first game, isn't it? Yeah. Making Rami Ashore do a lot of work to Suki here. Oh, he's done him. He's done him. Oh. <laughs> that was a joke shot. How did he get this cross court? I have no idea. It was so far behind him and tight to the side wall. Oh, I hate it when that happens. Do you like it when the players fist pump when they're pleased they've won a rally? Yeah. It's good, isn't That's it? That's what I do sometimes. Good lad. I like the fist pump. 
So second game ball for Ferris Dasuki to level up. Hand out, 12-11, game ball. Hand out. I think Ferris Dasuki is going to definitely have to change 12, his T-shirt after this game second ball. game, Sumner. Yeah, it's dripping on the so, court. Yeah. Do you like his nickname, Fearless Ferris? Yeah. What would your nickname be? Um, I'm not sure, but I think my dad came up with a load of them. Did he? <laughs> Did he? Are they nice ones? I don't know. Right. I forgot. But I think I know uh, um, Rami's, um, Rami's nickname. Isn't it the artist? Decision to zoom it is, in. yeah. He's, he's yes, been called the artist by a lot of the squash fans. Game ball. Video review to Zuki on the yes let decision. And isn't Greg the general? He is, yeah. He is the general, yeah. Can you remember uh, any yes, others? Yes, he had the review, yeah. Nick um, Matthew? Ten off. The wolf. The wolf. James Wallstrop? Um, not sure. He's trying to get a stroke here to Suki. I feel that he should have played that ball. So if it's not a stroke, Sumner. I think he should have played that. Okay. Yeah, he should have played it quite right. He had loads of area it, to play it, that. At least a lap. I think probably a lap. No, yeah. It's another good yes, decision. Yes, decision upheld. Dazuki has no reviews remaining. 12-11. Game ball. The camera's falling down. Well, we've just had uh, clarification there from Sumner that one of the cameras apparently has fallen on the court. We're not sure which one. I was a bit worried then, PJ. I thought they were uh, going to actually, they were coming for us to take us uh, out of the venue. Yeah, I think so. Both had our hands held up, but... Uh, That's all right, we're in safe hands. Sumner would have held the fort, wouldn't you? You'd have taken over. Yeah. No problem. Camera two, it's that new camera angle. No, he's got to go oh, and play that. What's he done here? What is the Suki got to play done here? Decision, oh, why has he gone for a... I mean, this is straightforward. Oh, he's no, got to go around and play the ball there. Why doesn't he play it, though? Sumner, why don't you think he play? He should play that? He was there to it's play what, it. It's what some players do. They don't decide to play it. They don't go into run. And they need to um, actually run into it. Just no, lazy. Yeah, exactly. No exactly. attempt to you play the ball. You know what? You've hit the nail on the head there because it's, it's just being lazy. You could have played that ball straight and actually won the rally. Yeah. So he's been penalised for that, Sumner. So he's been given a no left, which, which is, is really it's poor. It's his own fault because um, he um, didn't go into the ball. Exactly. Quite right. Yeah. And he would have and got that. Ball. Easily. He would have got it easily. He was just looking for the, for the point. So a big mistake from Dasuki. 12 all in this tie break. This is a really long game. This is probably as long as one of your matches, isn't it? Yeah. Very Decision quick last. Suzuki. Yes, let. 12 all. He could have played. He, I think he could have got that. Yeah, look, look for the ball. Look for the ball. Look to play the ball. Yes, let. 12 all. Very loose from Remy Ashore. I think he was a bit lucky there. Yeah. What's this game? His t shirt's getting wetter by the minute. How do they get so sweaty though when they've only been on? Oh, two this games? oh my goodness me. Sorry, Sumner. Just get very excited when they start unleashing those cross court nicks. That was a great shot, wasn't it, by Dasuki? I just hate it when that happens because Perry and Curtis always do it to me and I hate it. <laughs> they always hit cross court nicks. Yeah. Off your service. Yeah. Therefore, you need to serve either at them or into the sidewall. There they are. Look, they're laughing about and it now, 13, saying 12, that they're going to talk about that time they hit the cross court nick against you. Yeah. So game ball again for Dasuki. 
still a lot of life in the prediction I of might, I think we Sumner. might just squeeze this in. It's a terrific second game though, isn't it? Really yeah. good, high quality squash. I think he's just going to sneak this one. wonder how long this second game is, PJ, just alone. I think this is going to be up in over the 20 minute mark. So what's the longest match you've ever seen? Oh, good question. The longest match I've ever seen. Probably about an hour. And Actually, I watched, uh, there was a junior tournament I watched at, in Cairo, believe it or not, Cairo Stadium. It was the World Junior Championships and it was John Russell against Ahmed Faizi and it was two hours and 23 minutes. Three games to two. That is long. Mm. That was... Oh, he's made the error. Team. It's forehand side again, this time hitting the top of the tin. There was another similar scenario where Dasuki walloped it in the bottom. Premier Shaw is it's battling away. He's making too many errors, oh. both of them, and making quite a couple of too, quite a couple of errors. Yep. Now nah, muck up the game. Very important game this one as well, Sumner, because Premier Shaw is winning by one game to love. If he wins in this game and goes two love up, it's a very big advantage, isn't it, between yeah. two love and one all? Big difference, Sumner. It's a big difference, isn't it? Yeah. It's a long way back when if you're losing two games to love as opposed to one game all. So crucial, really, if Tasuki is going to have a chance tonight, you feel he has to win this second game. That is a good shot. That's a wicked shot, that one. That's like my shot sometimes. On the backhand. Yeah. I just, lo I, I just love hitting Decision. it hard on the side no and then sometimes it goes in the neck. 14-13, game ball. But Dasuki was trying to get a let ball on that one. Roy Gingell having none of it. No, it's, just too, it's in the neck too much. He wouldn't have got it. So Ramia Shaw with his first game ball. And he's got the nick. Here's a question for you. If you played that shot, what happened there, and it hit the nick behind the service box, would you apologise to your opponent or would you walk to the front wall and have a bit of a giggle? Probably do both, actually. You would. So that's, <laughs> even, that's even better. I'd probably go, yes. <laughs> and just like, do a little giggle in my head, yeah. Because it's a good shot. We went for it. He's stitched himself. Stroke ashore. He stitched himself up there. He didn't have to hit this as hard. He'd done the work on the forehand side, Dasuki. Hand out 15 14. He'd hit a really nice ball. tight ball on that forehand side, and it was loose. I think sometimes on those cross court nicks on the forehand, PJ, he hits it a bit too hard, and if yeah, it doesn't go in the nick, it comes right back at too him. Too far back, yeah, a little bit yeah. more of a subtle. Hit into that front corner. Better pace. There's, a, there's quite a couple of nicks in this game. That's a very, very exciting second game here. They're, u they're, they're using everything. They're hitting nicks and winners and they're retrieving well. Good length. It's a top quality game of squash. Yeah. Well, it almost looks as though Ferris Dasuki is getting used to playing Rami Ashore now. In the first game, miss. he wasn't quite sure what to do against uh, Rami. But in this game, he seems to be understanding how to play him a little bit better. Seems very close. Still, there's life in your prediction at the moment for Ferris Dasuki to take this second game. 15 all. Still confident about it? If he just keeps it up and keeps Rami um, like this, he'll probably um, win it this game. This is the, this is the and out. tough 16, part about 15. Rami Ashore is that game he's suddenly ball. able to win a quick point like he just did there. And he's yeah. serving with game ball in a flash.
He's got him. Well, Dasuki's gone down. I think uh, Dasuki's okay. He's just uh, okay. Well, summing up, got a question for you here. A few people yeah. have been listening to your um, predictions on social media, and they've been so impressed Are you okay? with everything so far. They would like to know who do you think will be the next number one in the world? Out of a everyone. Ap apart from Curtis, obviously. Okay. <laughs> um. Obviously, Mohamed El Shabagi is the current world number one. So who will take his position as number one in the world after him? Um, I think it might be... Um, decision, Dezuki. I'm not Video really decision, sure, but Dezuki. Greg's a really good player as well. Greg yep. Gautier is a very, very good... Uh, so he's just choice. waiting so on this decision. Sorry, guys. I think he might be the next one. You think Gautier will go back to number one? Yeah, or Nick Matthew. Or Nick, right. Well, what do you reckon on this one? This is a huge point, guys. And Dasuki's taking a racket, but unintentionally into the stomach. Is Ramya Shaw's shot too good for it to be uh, a let ball? It's a big I've decision for the video referee. I think referee. that should be a um, yes let. Really? Yes. I don't understand where he's got caught in the stomach there, but it's obviously just slightly by the, the butt of the racket from ashore after he's played the shot. Well, the official's taking a long time over this one, just wants to make sure, which is fair enough, because it is a huge point. I think he hit him with the um, elbow. Cause huge point. I'm not sure this is a let ball, really. Ball's gone up front. The contact is after he's played it. Oh, ho, ho. Yeah, it was close. Yes, that sir. was close. He 16, took his time 15, over it. Game ball. So still. That must have hurt a bit when you've been, when you've been running around a lot. Got, it looked like he got winded, didn't it? Have you ever been yeah. winded like that? Right somebody... box. I, I don't think I know what it feels like, but I think I have. 16-15 game ball. Didn't actually touch him. Oh, I, I didn't see any contact at all, personally. No, that's extraordinary. He's still kind of heaving his chest and stomach. Do you two think it's, he's taking it or? Oh, oh dear, oh dear, Rami. Well, it doesn't matter. Because Rami is sure taking just... full advantage. Go on, you say the, the lower third, as we call it. Okay. Two, um, the score is now two games to love to Ramia Shaw.